Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's a cleaning mommy here. And tonight I'm sharing with you some after dark cleaning motivation. One of my favorite time to clean is at night. This is when I get to be by myself and just enjoy the process. I don't get to do this a lot because I'm always in mommy mode, but tonight I get to share it with you. And guys, this video is a collab with A. It's Mandy, so I'm going to let her introduce herself. Hey guys, my name is Mandy and over on my channel, you're going to find a ton of realistic, real life cleaning motivation. I do a lot of decluttering and some decor as well. I'm from Virginia and I live with my fiance Ruben and our three-year-old yellow lab Bodie. I also have two boys that are grown and have already moved out of the house and I also work full-time outside of the house and YouTube is something that I do on the side. I absolutely love it and I love meeting new people. So if you guys come over from PETA's video, make sure you let me know in the comments below. I would love to come and say hello to you personally. I hope you enjoy today's video and if you like what you see, make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Don't forget to follow me over on Instagram as well. I can't wait to meet you all. So guys, now that Mandy has introduced herself to you, I would love if you guys go over to her channel and show her channel some love and support, as well as letting her know that I sent you. And if you're coming over from Mandy's channel, welcome. I'm so happy to have you here. I would love for you to hit that subscribe button. If you enjoy my content on my channel, you can find cleaning, you can find decorating, you can find organization and decluttering. I do a few cooking as well as I have a, a vlog channel called the Henry Family Vlog. So if that is something that you guys enjoy watching, I would love for you guys to subscribe to this channel as well as go to my vlog channel and show some love and support. I love to have you guys a part of the family. I have so much amazing content coming for you guys and I cannot wait to share it with you. So I would love if you guys hit that notification bell as well. So whenever I post, you guys do not miss out. <music> time to clean is at night because this is when my family goes to bed I can turn my music up and I can just be in the zone and just enjoy the moment I don't get to do this a lot because if you guys don't know if you're new I just had a baby a couple months ago and you know she's in the stage of waking up several times at night as well as I have a two-year-old toddler and he loves being right up on me. And then I have my five-year-old, which on the weekends, he doesn't go to bed early. And during the weekdays, he goes to school. So he has a bedtime, but we aren't strict on bedtime. So sometimes he's up really late. I am such a night person. So for me, I don't go to bed till like... 12 1 2 o'clock in the morning and then when i have to wait on my family to go to bed by 10 o'clock after that who wants to clean after that as much as i love to clean at night i really don't want to clean after 10. so now that i'm finished tidying up the room and i made my bed you guys see i'm on making my bed <laughs> because i am getting ready to bring the kiddos to bed so that I can go in the living room and tidy up and you guys are probably wondering why did I clean make my bed just to unmake it well I absolutely love making my bed and I just like the peace and the calm of my master bedroom just looking clean and well taken care of that is my oasis that's my getaway spot from the kids because i can just close the door and just chill so i love to have my bed made and about an hour after i made the bed i ended up putting the kids to bed so my kids still sleep in the bed with me i would love for them to sleep in their own room but they won't do it so they sleep in the bed with me. 
So now I am in the living room and as you guys can see, it's a tad messy. So we're going to clean up all these toys, wipe down the boys table because you know when kids eat, they make a mess of everything. I'm going to fix up the pillows on the couch and y'all, when I tell you one of the reasons why I love to clean at night, you guys are going to see because I love to dance, listen to music sing y'all i may not can i may not be able to sing but i'm gonna let out a tune <laughs> or two so you guys are definitely gonna see that in this video so i hope you guys enjoy it because i wanted to make cleaning fun y'all cleaning does not have to feel like a chore it can be fun and in this video you are gonna see that i was having so much fun while getting the house in order to reset for the next day on the grass i don't need to feel lonely i am finally home at last one thing's for sure my couch is always a mess under the pillows or under the couch itself you can always find food that my kids eat or you can find toys underneath the couch it's just always a mess so i wanted to vacuum up all the crumbs that was underneath the pillows and just get the couch clean i bought this couch and when i saw it online i really liked it but if I had to purchase it again, I probably would not. Just because the material is just attracting every particle possible. And it is so hard to clean. I bought several different um, cleaning products to clean it. And they're just not being successful and I'm really trying to figure out what I can get to help clean this couch because it's so filthy and it's a one-sided so it's not like I can turn it over and then it's not like I can wash it either because even though it has zipper it doesn't pull all the way out so the zipper will open but the pillow cover cannot come off so I try to clean it I do the best that I can but I wish I knew what I could use to get it clean so if you guys have any opinion on what I could use I would definitely love for you to tell me down in the comment section and I don't boys have most of their toys in their room i do keep one storage bin of toys in the living room i always tell my boys that they need to clean their kitchen because they make a mess and i already have one kitchen to clean i do not need a second one and they always look at me weird like mommy what are you talking about <laughs> So I wanted to wipe down their kitchen because it had a lot of food particles on there. My boys, especially Jeremiah, my two-year-old, he loves to pretend cook. And he'll go in the fridge and get stuff and pretend that he's cooking. So then he always makes a lot of mess, but he never cleans up after himself. So I always go behind him and wipe down his kitchen and I'm using the Mrs. Myers multi-surface cleaner to wipe down everything tonight. I still have my peppermint scent. You guys are watching this video. I recorded it in February, but you guys are watching it in March. So I still had my Mrs. Myers peppermint scent that I'm using. I absolutely love this. I wish it was a yearly thing instead of seasonal. I'm using the carpet refresher that I got from Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree have some really great cleaning items that you guys can get without breaking the bank. So I'm throwing it on the carpet and I'm just going to let it sit for a while and then I'm going to vacuum it up. 
I feel like it works better when you just give it time to work instead of throwing it and vacuuming at the same time. So I let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes and then I vacuum it up. And y'all, when I tell you, it smells so good. But I'm a heavy handed, y'all. <laughs> I am so heavy handed when I'm throwing this product on my rug and my carpet. tend to throw so much that it doesn't last me a long time and I feel like it probably should last me at least four or five times but it does not thing about it is I know I'm coming back. Nobody wants to see us together but it don't matter no so as you guys can see i was having a jolly good time i love to make cleaning fun and turn it into a party and as you guys can see i was definitely having a lot of fun cleaning fun guys yes i know it's something that we have to do we have to keep our house tidy and in order but you don't want to make it feel like it's such a chore you want to make it feel fun and make it feel like something that you actually want to do i love to clean and sometimes i don't want to but once I turn my music on, I am good to go and I'm ready to have some fun while cleaning. Now that I'm finished cleaning the living room, I'm going to edit into the kitchen and I wanted to get the kitchen tidied up. As you guys can see, there were so many dishes in the sink and I definitely wanted to get the kitchen clean so that I did not have to wake up in the morning and have to worry about getting the house in order. I go, I'm coming home to you. One thing about cleaning at night, guys, that I will say I do miss is I know you guys have seen in a lot of my cleaning videos where my two year old toddler, as soon as I'm in the kitchen and getting ready to do the dishes, he runs and come in to help. And I definitely miss that when he's in bed, knocked out sleep, and I have to do the dishes all by myself. Coming home to you. So I'm going to share something with you guys that I don't really talk about a lot and that is I suffer from depression. Music for me is like my medicine. So whenever I'm feeling down, I'll just turn on some music and it makes me feel so much better. Now, I'm not saying the music or dancing takes the pain away. It doesn't. But in that moment, I'm thinking about something else. I'm not worried about whatever I'm feeling stressed or depressed about because I'm too busy focusing on having fun. I don't know if you guys suffer from any kind of ailment where you have something that takes your mind off how you feel. For me, it's music. Once I'm feeling down, I'll put in my headphone, my AirPods, whatever you want to call it, and I'll just zone out with my music. I'll start singing real loud. I'll start dancing. Sometimes my son will come and tell me to be quiet because I'm too loud. But whenever I'm in my zone of listening to music, I always feel so much better. 
So I would suggest if you're watching this video and you suffer from depression or sometimes you just feel so stressed out, find something that will help take your mind off it in that moment because sometimes all you need is a moment to just step back relax Why? i'm always feeling homesick you guys are enjoying this video i hope you guys are getting so much cleaning motivation i hope you guys are having fun with me just dancing and just having a good time while trying to get your house in order but guys i don't want another minute to pass by without me introducing myself to you guys so to all my newbies welcome your girl is so happy to have you here if you were new my name is peter gay i'm the cleaning mommy on my channel i do cleaning i do decorating i do decluttering organization anything that involves turning a house into a home you guys can find it here on this channel if that is something that you guys enjoy watching i would love for you guys to become a part of the family by hitting that subscribe button hitting that notification bell, sharing because it's absolutely free. And don't forget to like as well. Leave me a comment, guys, because I definitely love talking to each and every one of you. And I always answer every single comment. So I would love for you guys to hit that subscribe button and become a part of the family. So guys, as you can see, I am cleaning up the kitchen. I'm getting rid of the food that we ate earlier for dinner, putting it away for the next day. I am not a big fan of leftovers, but what I cooked for dinner was definitely not going to waste. And what I cooked was, um, I think it was stew peas and rice. If you guys don't know what that is, that's a dish that I make. It's a dish that is made in my country in Jamaica. It is one of my absolutely favorite dish. So as you guys can see, my microwave was filthy. I try so hard to keep this microwave clean, but I have a five-year-old and a two-year-old and they are at the independent stage where they want to do everything themselves. So they always make their little pizza snacks and put it in the microwave and always, I can always tell you, they are going to forget to put the lid over the food and turn on the microwave and not have it mess it up. But, you know, I am proud that they're trying to do things on their own. So I just let them be independent. So the trash is something my husband always does. But whenever I'm cleaning, I always empty out the trash, put it in the garage, and he'll take it outside to put it in the bigger trash. One thing about my home is it's always so dusty. So I always have to sweep up something every single day not to mention food from my boys so now that i'm finished sweeping i am gonna wipe up the floor and y'all i was digging in the trash can because i accidentally threw the cover for the bleach bottle in the trash whenever i'm wiping the floor i always use bleach and that's because I have kids and they are always playing on the floor. And I want to make sure the floor is as sanitized as possible. Just because, you know, kids and germs, it's like they are best friends. 
Can we just mention how cute my bed slippers are? <laughs> they look so cute. So I'm finished wiping up the kitchen and now I'm in the living room and I'm just going to wipe it up. And then I am going to take the boys' laundry in their room. I absolutely do not like doing laundry, but it has to get done. So once I'm finished wiping up the living room, I'm going to show you guys the after. And then I am going to head into Journey's room. She had so much laundry that needed to be put away. So I'm going to tackle that as well. And perhaps I'm going back But I don't have to be chasing every Guys, don't forget to check out Aids Mandy's channel Definitely go check her video out and let her know I sent you And don't forget to subscribe to show her channel love, guys So whenever Journey's room is messy, that's because one or both of my boys in her room playing so i'm just gonna put away all the stuff that they were messing with as well as taking out the trash again guys i normally never mess with the trash i leave that for my husband but because i was cleaning and the trash was full i said let me just do it so that the next day he would not have to worry about it so i'm folding up journey's clothes as well as i was looking at clothes that i know she has that no longer fit so that i can prepare my mind for eventually one day getting rid of everything i'm either gonna donate or add to my poshmark store so if you guys don't know i do have a poshmark store i will leave it in the description so that you guys can go and check it out after I finished putting away Journey's clothes, I am going to vacuum her room. And guys, I know I did not say hi to all my old friends. So I'm saying hi to you guys because you know what? You guys have been here since day one supporting my channel. You guys always show my videos love. So I definitely cannot leave you guys out. I would be such a bad friend if I did that. So welcome to all my old friends. I love you guys and I really appreciate each and every time you guys click on my video and show my channel love and support. It means so much to me and I could not do this without you guys and thank you guys for all your comments i really do appreciate it because y'all you guys may not know but i am such an introvert i am super shy so me doing youtube and putting myself out there and i'm always thinking the worst when i was younger my mom used to call me miss negative or negative nancy because I always see the worst in things. I never see the good. So you guys showing my channel love means so much to me. So thank you guys so much. So now that I'm in my boy's room, as you guys could see, I am just tidying up, vacuuming their floor. And guys, at this point, it was like 1230 in the morning. And as you can see, I have a little friend that came to visit. He woke up from his nap. Whenever I'm not beside him, it's like he can sense it. And I was so not happy he woke up because I was like, okay, I want to finish cleaning at 1 o'clock. I believe it was 1 o'clock, I said. I don't remember. But I think, for example, I said I want to finish at 1 and then spend at least 30 minutes just meditating and just relaxing and spending some time with myself. Other than cleaning, I still love to just spend time sitting on the couch with a glass of wine and just relaxing. And y'all, as you can see, he woke up. But I did get to do that, guys. I definitely did. It just took longer because I had to wait for him to get tired again and go back to sleep. So, y'all, now I'm in the bathroom and I am doing a quick tidy up. 
as a boy mom, you know, we constantly have to clean the bathroom because with both my boys in the stage of pot, one is potty training, the other one is potty trained, but he still makes mess. So I'm constantly having to wipe the toilet down because there's always pee everywhere. So guys, recently I stopped showing me clean the inside of my toilet because <laughs> I was watching a video of somebody cleaning and when they lift up their toilet seat, it was just so filthy. And I was like, I cannot, I cannot, I just cannot show that and I just cannot watch that. And when it happened, I was eating. So it was super gross. So I just stopped doing that. But I do clean my bathroom toilets. I just do not do it on camera. So as you guys can see, it's late at night, but I'm still doing laundry. I'm always doing laundry. Even now that I'm doing this voiceover, I'm not cleaning. I'm doing a voiceover. And I had my uh, son clothes. I was trying to the method that everybody is doing where you do one load a day. So I put my toddler's clothes in the washing machine and I was washing it while I'm doing this voiceover. So I'm finished cleaning the bathroom and now I'm putting in the rugs and I'm about to turn the light off. And y'all, I was not going to bed just yet. I still wanted some relaxing me time, which is exactly what I'm going to do. I love to spend time with myself. I love to get to know myself even more. And I think as moms and as a wife, we are always so consumed with our husband and our kids that sometimes we forget to have time for ourselves. So definitely make time for yourself, guys. Trust me. It helps with your mental. When you find time for you, it definitely helps. So guys, I just want to say thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. I know my voice sound horrible, but thank you guys. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Dream that